Hi everybody and welcome to Malangata Station in the Yalgoo re region of Western Australia. I'm going to give you another damper recipe. As far as I'm concerned, you can never have too many damper recipes. Now I use the same basic damper as I always do, but this one's got a little surprise in it. So let's get in and see what we need to make the damper surprise. So my recipe is two cups of self-raising flour, two tablespoons of oil, olive oil, vegetable oil, canola oil, whatever you like, uh, a good pinch of salt and enough water to make a stiff dough. And we need a tray to cook it on and we also, the surprise bit in this one, is we need a whole camembert cheese. Just a little one, doesn't have to be a huge great big one, but that's our surprise that we're going to put in our damper. So we just need to add two cups of flour to our bowl. We need to make a little well in the middle of our bowl and then we need to add two tablespoons of oil, a good pinch of salt and then enough water to combine all the ingredients to make a stiff dough. A little bit like when you're making scones. So mix all that together. So there you go. That is exactly how your damper dough needs to look. When you touch it, it doesn't stick to your fingers too much. Perfect. And then we pop it out onto a floured surface and we just flatten it out to make a big disc. Once we've got the disc in it, disc should be around about maybe a centimetre and a half, maybe two centimetres thick. And that whole camembert goes right in the middle of your damper. Then we encase it with the damper dough, turn it upside down so then all of the joins are underneath. Then we're just going to put a little bit of water on the top of the damper, put a couple of little slits in it as well. And today I'm going to just sprinkle some poppy seeds over the top just to give it a little bit of an extra sort of sophisticated look in the bush. Yep. So now our beautiful little damper surprise is ready to be put into the camp oven. Now I have got a trivet on the inside of the camp oven just to get the tray up off the base and put the lid on. You might notice that that thing, my coals are actually quite small. That's because the timber that I've got here is actually not very big. So I'll just need to add some more. And I'm going to put them just around the edge because by leaving that gap in the middle means that the top of my damper is not going to cook too quick and it's all the hot air inside that is going to cook my food. So that's it. Now 15 minutes we'll come back and we'll check on that. Okay, let's see what we've got in here. Checked it at 15 minutes and I needed just a little bit more heat. Oh, look at that. Cooks perfectly. Oh. Beautiful. Absolutely perfect. So, there we have. Look, the cheese all in the middle and the damp on the outside. Nice and warm and gooey just perfect to go with a really nice cold beer.